Crankshaft, C, bottom of the page. Exhaust camshaft, E, upper left corner. Exhaust camshaft. Inlet camshaft, I, upper right corner of the picture. Inlet camshaft. Piston, P, middle of the picture. P, piston. Connecting rod, R, middle of the picture, underneath the piston. Connecting rod. Spark plug, S. Top of the picture, right in the middle. Spark plug. Exhaust valve, colored in red. Exhaust valve, V, in red. That's the intake, intake valve, intake valve. Cooling water ducts, W. Cooling water ducts, left-hand side of the picture, W. Is this a two-stroke or four-stroke engine? Watch the picture. Answer, this is a two-stroke engine, a two-stroke engine. Question, is this a two- or four-stroke engine? Watch the picture. Answer, this is a four-stroke engine, four-stroke engine. Oh my goodness, what's that? That is a lever. Oh my goodness, what's that? Under the lever, what's that? That's a fulcrum. Oh my goodness, what's that? That's a horizontal plane. What's that? That's an inclined plane. What's that? That is a load. Notice the inclined plane is 30 meters and the height off of the ground to the top is 5 meters. The y-axis value is 5 and the sloped line is 30 meters. What is the mechanical advantage? The mechanical advantage is 30 meters over 5 meters slope over the five meters, the height, and that gives us six. Mechanical advantage equals what? Mechanical advantage is the number of times a machine multiplies your effort force. It is a measure of the force amplification achieved by using a tool, mechanical device, or machine system. Here is a screw. A screw is a mechanism that converts rotational motion. You're cranking away on the handle. Converts rotational motion to linear motion. See the blue thingy majig on top of the screw. It's going linearly, horizontally, left and right. And it also converts torque, rotational force, to a linear force. So it converts rotational motion to linear motion and Rotational force, torque, to linear force. It is one of the six classical simple machines. The most common form consists of a cylindrical shaft with helical grooves or ridges called threads around the outside. And that brings us to the end. Bye-bye now.